Okay. What I'm trying to do is better because oh, okay. uh, mm -hmm. it's an attempt at figuring things out. Oh. Uh, I would like to eventually become good enough at it to the point where I can contribute. All right, <laughs> fuck you. Seriously, <laughs> where I can contribute to uh, a larger debate about why this uh, country's so fucked up. Like, for example, why is it that a 50 whatever year old fire chief feels the need to get stoned every night? Right? I mean, what is it? about life in America that's driving that urge in him. Hmm. He likes it? <laughs> Fine. But then there's something slightly wrong with the fact that someone with that type of responsibility is constantly high. <laughs> I'm serious. Maybe there's something this, worth exploring. This there, right? firehouse happens to have the best record in the but city. I don't Vince, know if that... If my is. house was on fire, I wouldn't want his high ass anywhere right, near it. You are so up yourself. Look, if okay. the guy has a good record, it's because he's lucky. That's it. <laughs> Says who? It's obvious, man. He's living this big luck-driven lie. Yeah. Are you high? No, I'm All serious. Right. <laughs> You're making movies about guys who rob Popeye's fried chicken. Okay. I, hey, not, hey. I am telling a story which aims to resonate the notion <laughs> of where our society's headed if we're not careful. If it sounds a little pompous, it's only because I haven't fully honed my skills yet. Mm. It doesn't sound pompous. It sounds like you're talking out your ass. <laughs> Why? Because you have no idea where society is headed, okay? You are just like everybody else, all right? You're just following the latest trend, which you hope will get you laid until that trend switches to something else, at which point you'll drop the old one and start making movies about, you know, whatever. Turtles getting caught in fishing nets. You don't like my work? I like it like I like a shot of whiskey first thing in the morning. You know, it's good for about ten minutes and then I want my coffee. Wow. What? Now you're all sensitive? Did I say something to piss you off, Vince, or is it that you're just a dick? Uh... Well, both. Well, at least you're finally admitting it. Unlike <laughs> some of us. What? That I'm a dick? Yeah. Uh, when? Well, we're speaking figuratively. When was I figuratively a dick? Uh, high school. What? I was too shy to be a dick in high school. Hey, buddy, give yourself a little credit. I think you held your own. That's because everyone's a dick in high school, Vince. It's the white male football playing prerogative. The trick is to evolve into something else once you're out. John, you're wearing two hundred dollars shoes. Okay, first of all, that's not true. Oh, what? what One fifty. I'm less shy than I was in high school. Oh, great. So now you're an overt dick. No, I'm a thoughtful person who happens to like nice shoes. And is occasionally full of shit. I, is there something I'm not doing that you want me to do, Vince? I don't want you to do anything. No, because it seems like I'm being asked to do something by uh, a 28-year-old pot dealer who doesn't have the guts to progress with the rest of society, which would be fine if it was a legitimate rebellion. Instead of just some lonely guy hanging out in a motel room wearing boxer shorts, acting like a potentially violent dick. You want to get high? No. Come on, John. Let's get high. I'm not getting high. Oh, why? Only potentially violent dicks get high? No. So, let's get high. I'm not getting high. No, I am. Fine. What's that going on in that bag, Vince? Pot. How much? A lot. B for party. A for all night long. R for reaper. T for turn me on. Well, why not? P A R T Y. Party, party. Let's get high.
Is out here? Where? Here. Lansing. Who? Amy. Amy Randall? Mm hmm. <sighs> yeah. Tracy told me that a couple of years ago. When I found out that you got this thing, I looked her up on the net. And. She's out here. She's like an assistant district attorney or something. Huh. Did you call her? I thought about it. You should, man. And especially now that Leia's... Out of the picture? Yeah. Hmm. Wonder if she's still hot? Yeah. That's not a very politically appropriate way to speak about a woman now, is it, John? Yeah. Okay, okay, you know what? Here's the thing about being appropriate. It's better to try to do that than to be a complete asshole. The choice to respect people is actually a good one, despite people like you who insist on calling fat people fat to their faces. And what if they are fat? If they are fat, then they probably already realize it without your having to remind them. You know, it basically just comes down to having a, a couple of manners. Oh, is that what it is? Yeah. Hmm. Well, then why'd you ask if she was still hot, Miss Manners? Because she is. She was. That, that's, no, no, no. That's not a bad word. If the word is essentially a compliment, then saying it isn't bad manners. Human beings like to be called attractive. I, I'm not labeling Amy Randall anything she doesn't already know. And I'm sure she's smart, too. Well, well I think we should call her up. And if we find out that she weighs uh, 320 pounds, I think that we should say to her, uh, gee... We're really glad that we dated you in high school instead of now, because back then, you were really hot. And now, I'm sure you realize about now. You know what, Vince? What? Why don't you just shut up for a while? Oh, well, I see. So I, I made a point. So I should shut up. No, it's that you like being rude for the sake of it. Either that or you do it to prove that nobody can make you be nice. Either way, it gets tiresome. And, and you and I don't see each other often enough to make worthwhile this little competition for who's more authentic, okay? It, it's not about that anymore. We, we're just, we should just accept the fact that we're a little different from each other and let the friendship go from there. Accept the fact that we're a little different from each other. Yeah. Would you like to make me? Make you what? Accept that fact? No. Why not? Because it's stupid. No, it's not. Yes, it is. No, it's not. How else will I know that you're different? You'll just have to trust me. No. Prove it. Or else what? Or else I'll kick your ass. Well, I guess this means you are potentially violent. Only when it comes to you, John.